fair. <laughs> That's a bigger knot here on this side. Yeah, it no. is. It's already torn out of there. Look how much is in there. That's what he's feeling internally. Yeah. He's, whoa, gee. <laughs> yeah, I think I found why he's got a knot there. <laughs> That is tough. They're difficult. <laughs> the grip is what really gets you. Hey, doing, Mike? Good. How are you? How was that? I'm uh, back. <laughs> you did great. Uh, go ahead and tell me a little bit about how you felt after that first visit. How uh, if you felt any soreness or how you know how the process went after that visit. It's funny you say that because all the comments were saying, "Oh, he must be really sore for a whole week." And honestly, I wasn't at all. Okay. I went right in the pool when I got home, was in there for a couple hours, and honestly, I didn't really feel sore at all. It was okay. more relief than anything. Beautiful. A ton yeah. of relief. All right. Anything else going on today? Anything you feeling today differently or in terms of uh, me check anything else? Just you know what's funny? Mm -hmm. Last time, my between my right scapula and my spine mm -hmm. was where the cramp was, mm -hmm. and now it's like transitioning to my left side. Okay. So something else is compensating for something. Cross your arms. All right. Take one deep breath in for me. And then let your head go back, let all the air out, let it go, let it go. Good, deep breath in, here we go. Head back for me. Let all the air out, here we go. Nice. Deep breath in, let all the air out. Nice, very good. Good one too. No, it, even the sounds weren't that loud, and that signifies that we're getting closer to the home position. On your side facing me, put the back of your head in that little slit. That'll hold you there, perfect, you got it. I'm just gonna stretch. I may have cracked second. a little bit. You're fine. You're just gonna stretch a little bit. There we go. Exhale. Deep breath in. Exhale. Here we go. There we go. Oh, that's okay. All right, so go to the side for me. Go to the side for me. Deep breath in. There we go. There it is. Good. There we go. Let's oh, go. Face up for me. It's okay. Face up. It's all the exercises you have me doing. There we go. Much better, much more balanced. A little bit, yeah, a little tiny bit on the right. Mm -hmm. The last couple of days I noticed that. Very gentle. I got you, brother. There we go. There we go. Let this side go. Oh, it's okay. Uh, I'm waiting. Let me have it. Okay, yeah, okay. It All wants right. to yeah, go. It's okay. We'll try. We'll go deeper in a second. I'm okay. Keep that chin up. Right, there you go. Now relax. All right, it's okay. And then he brings the knuckles in. Oh, no. <laughs> the knuckles. He was nicer on the first visit, and then he was mean. <laughs> yeah, it's usually honeymoon's over, and now all of a sudden, uh -huh, he changed. <laughs> Why are there penguins in my happy place? Oh. This is just coercion. I'm just trying to work the vertebrae closer to where it's supposed to be so it'll, it'll adjust easier. Does it still feel fluidy in No, no, no. It does not, does not feel fluidy. I think he's got, it's actually not so misaligned, mm -hmm. so you're not going to get a loud click out of it. There we go. The more forward your posture is, the more the distance the adjustment takes you, so the louder the joint sound will be when you close it, like a door. You know, the more you can swing the door, the more it'll sound. It's not, mm -hmm. not really the, you can have bones move without the sound. It's not required. You know, it's 
I know it's satisfying, but it's not something that we have to have. It's we're looking for I'm looking for suppleness to your atlas and axis, and what that tells me is that your lower neck's not going to be overstressed, and that's the whole point. But we can full parade. I want the click. Lovely. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> now I can breathe. <laughs> Frequently, I'll comb everywhere, but the mark will only come out in certain places. This is, you know, opposing to the idea that I'm just bursting things. If, it, if that was possible, why didn't it burst everywhere? Mm -hmm. It doesn't burst everywhere because there's only the mark only comes out where there's an acidity inside, where there's a scar, tangle, mm -hmm. and that's one right there. It's not as bad yes. though. Jaw issues ever? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I used to kind of do the same thing you're doing. Yeah, you want to release the masseter. This muscle is what grinds and binds up this TMJ. <laughs> yep, lovely. That, but it's mm, not you're not really yeah, doing seen a that too. adjustment. It's really you're you're really just trying to get some mechanical force into this joint to try to release some of the musculature that that's around this joint. So whenever you adjust a joint, any any muscles around the joint typically relax. So it's a way to get this masseter to relax. I'm just I'm not a huge fan of going in there and trying to throw it around. Yeah, throw it around. I just release this masseter. The main reason why it's tight in the first place is because your head's forward. So any any adjustment or even massage to it is counterintuitive to fixing the problem, which is just getting the head back. Mm -hmm. The more forward the head goes, it jams. The TMJ gets jammed when the head goes forward. Mm -hmm. So re reducing forward head posture relieves stress on the TMJ. So getting the head back, getting the chest in. So those, those, those two components are what have to be addressed. We've got to get the thoracic cage in, get the retract the head back, get the ear over the shoulder, and then the TMJ will calm down. Let it go, let it go, there we go. There it is, a little piece. Let me have it. Let it go, let it go right. All right, a little bit. Let's go face down for me and then shirt off. Yeah. Same spot. Good times. Yep. There we are. Breathe. All right. Yeah, this one still can get a name. We still can name that one. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. <laughs>
That's a monster. It's going to hold it and see if it'll dissipate a little bit. There it is. Mm -hmm. Plenty of places are trying to do this to, I don't know, relax or soothe the patient. We're trying to break down this knot. Yep. You know, it's this correction we're going for here. We're not, you know, we're not trying to make friends. <laughs> Edge, you're going too hard on the poor guy. We're trying to break that wall down. All right, last push here. Here we go. creating a pocket that he's going to bring his head back into. This all has to be drawn out of here. If this exists, you can't retract the head. The chest, if it's, if this is all, you say that you're fine. If, it, if this is all popped up, you can't retract the head. This has to come in to allow the head to come back. So when you're reducing forward head posture, we have to create space first. It's like moving furniture, you know, one piece has to move over a little bit and then the other one can move over. Maybe like dominoes. Oh, that one's loud. I mean, this one's, yeah, it's different up here. Elevator scapula is definitely different on this side. This is a crunch there on the top. Like somebody moving in a drawer, sometimes as you push in one side of the drawer, now the other side stuck. feels will not feel stuck or, or farther out of position. And then together, eventually the drawers level, and then the, they slide in together evenly. So after you push one side in, then this side feels more stuck. They both need to go forward in order to get the head back. No! <laughs> <laughs> 
Mm -hmm. Besides, yeah. <laughs> All right, back to pain. We're good. Mm -hmm. There we go. Yeah. There it is. Got some stuff hidden. That top part of the scapula, bottom part of the scapula, all around here. You've got. Tickles and then pain and then tickles and then pain. <laughs> it's just back and forth. Oh. Last time one spot, and this time all around the skip, you know. All around. Oh no, not the other side. Scraped him harder there. No, there's. Oh, no, yeah, you can feel something different. Yeah, there. there's. Yeah. better. It's not, not nearly. I know it's sore, but... Mm-hmm. 
more forward the shoulder goes, the more of these muscles, rhomboids, have to pull harder, and then they grow larger as the posture gets worse, and so really the only way to dissipate this is fix the posture, and then you do have to go in here and release all this, otherwise it won't just correct. So this is like an idle screw on an engine, it's just turned up too high, and it's building up a lot of acidity. A lot of exhaust comes out of here. Got to get 20, 20 minute sessions on those stretches. That's our first goal. And then this will start calming down. It won't build up so much between visits and. Yeah. <laughs> yep, yep. Let's put that down by your side. There, yeah, good, good, good. This all has to stretch in order for your head to come back. there. <laughs> this is the back this is the front side of that same tissue that I hit from the back side. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, like I said, I comb this. <laughs> Not much, but right there, a lot. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I got to breathe for a second. <laughs> and then you're Give me some warning before you do that one. Oh. Gym a couple times a week, okay. but at home I'll constantly do pull-ups like 24/7. Okay. 
there's a pull up bar between my mm -hmm. office and the bathroom. So every time I walk by, I just. Gotcha. So just the goal is throughout the day, we're going to, as much as you're doing pull ups, you have to do some counter stretching because you're strengthening the front. Mm -hmm. And then the back is just, does that make sense? The more forward your shoulders yeah. go, the more those muscles have to no, anchor yeah, and pull. And you got to stretch your pecs. As much as you're strengthening your pecs, we want to stretch them. And that involves what we talked about last time. And then just throughout your day, not just one time before you go to bed, you want to intermittently, even if it's not full 20 minutes, but just give it a, Every once a few in a while. minutes, arch it back. And then at the end of the day, you get your meal. You do your 20 minute session, you lock it in and go for that stretch. And about, like I said, 20, 20 minute times, you should see, you can go to another level. You know, you'll be at this level 20 times, then this level 20 times, and eventually, all the way back. The posture will change, and then all that tightness around your scapula will change. I got you, buddy. Good. I know. I got you, buddy. Good. There we go. Good. Good. Shoulders are a little. That was me. That was me. <laughs> Exhale. There we go. Good. Nice. All right. Thunder interruption. Ah. A little cup of ice cream at the end. This isn't a cup of ice cream, this is a roller. This is the best part. There we go. It doesn't hurt. There After the elbow, right? Really shouldn't do any like when you're sitting seated, mm -hmm. you know. And you, guys that do this part one, yeah, no, that's a little scary. You don't, don't do that one. No, <laughs> that's the worst one for your neck and back is when they have a bar right here, right? And yeah, you pull, pull it from behind, behind, yeah, behind no. their neck because you got your arm at full. Yeah, no, my head's only like way behind me when I'm looking up at yeah, the this, bar. This one's okay. Yeah, that's right? all I do. Right, this one's okay, mm -hmm. but you never want to do. Yeah, that scares me. Okay, yeah, no. <laughs> good. Because no. don't do that one. That would that would just totally ruin. Yeah, definitely. Your back and yep. I'm gonna do like two. He's gonna do like 20. <laughs> so show you the bar is actually safe. And how far do you go down? All the way. All the way? Yeah. Shoot. I actually did it for the, uh, <laughs> I went to a fair and they had the Marines set up. And like if you do 20, you can get a, a t-shirt. So you have to go all the way down. It was the hardest thing I've ever done. Which way do you do at home? This way. Oh my gosh. He's doing that. <laughs> like this one was I had to do when I did the Marine thing too. Normally I'm like extra wide though, but can I start? Go ahead. Go ahead, yeah. He's, whoa, gee. <laughs> yeah, I think I found why he's got a knot there. <laughs> that power, that's awesome. That's what I do all day. You have awesome. a pencil up here. <laughs> it's for x ray. <laughs> he's he's like yeah, my head was above it. <laughs> The grip is what really gets you, too. <laughs> the grip is what really does it. Yeah. yeah. That's my workout for the day. That's amazing. Yep. Yeah. See, so you, you're going throughout your day. You're fine, yeah. Throughout your day, if you're doing that, we have to stretch back because all that pec strengthening is going to end our day. Exactly. Even afterwards, stretch your shoulders back and then on the roller, right? Yeah. Work on arching Huge back. Huge difference with your arms above your head too. Right, working on getting your head, arms back. I do this exact thing just without anything underneath my head. Good, all right, good. Huge progress though, watch when I put my knees to the side. Try it, yeah. See, normally I can hold my foam roller because it's wider. Okay. So it keeps my chest down and I can really like stretch it. Yeah. But right now. Yeah, good. Yeah. Beautiful. And before I can do it at all. Yeah. Was that three weeks ago? It's amazing.
And range of motion is like a currency. It can be, if you, if you value it, you can, you can make more of it. You can restore it. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. yeah. You want to do it after you do those workouts. It's, they're great, but you got to end, making sure we end in a better stretch posture. Back. That's right. Stretch them back. Bring it back to where it was. For longevity. Yeah. You got power, but now we got to get your range of motion posture. Very good. Look at that. Excellent. Head's on the ground, right? Yeah. 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 It looks good. We able to get twenty twenty, and then. And then, if one is a joke, when you come in here and go, Ed, that roller is, feels like nothing. Okay. Oh, there we go. Nice. Oh, that's good. The thumbs finally. There we go. I just got to get a little more. Yeah, there we go. Dinosaur bone on. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Get some grip. grip. that left flexor muscles are oh, that's bad there right here on this side I don't like that I like it it's rough yeah you right there yeah. area that's not unglued it's staying Catch what I feel. Oh, you can see that. That's, you see how quickly it comes up. There's, there's something right there. Didn't even know that was there. It's okay. <laughs> I literally feel muscles and tissue for a living. Exactly. <laughs> I shouldn't. I can, I can tell when it doesn't feel the way it's supposed to. And there's something right there. It's hidden. You got it under a layer, but there. It comes out right away too. Mm -hmm. That's, that's what's trapped. The backside feels pretty good. I got really scanning. A little bit over here, right there on the edge. Otherwise, oh, feels good. I did just do 20 pull-ups as uh -huh, so. <laughs> most impressive. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Jeez. I'm going to have to start practicing. Jeez. <laughs> Three. <laughs> Jeez. Yeah, it takes time. Jeez. It really does. At the bar right there, baby. Oh, great. Jesus. Great. <laughs> great. <laughs> Use it all the time. In between, it. In between patients. You got no, no excuses <laughs> now. No, man. <laughs> That's why I put it right between the, the office and the bathroom. That's a good idea. Uh, how quickly that came out. Look, let me see if you can see it. Yes. Mm -hmm. The 
with Mark of Ed. <laughs> No, no, <laughs> Jeez, silence gets forms. <laughs> Thanks. It's only because they're pumped up still. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Work on that chest and keep working on creating that pocket. You know, you just gotta get those. You gotta get 20 minutes. That whole upper back section, this section here. Keep working. Start up here. Work down here. Find the most difficult spot, and that's where you want to spend the most amount of time. Okay. That's your most bang for your buck on that. See that I can't do. Oh, okay. oh. Watch your foot when you come back down. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, okay. I'll give you credit with that. One. I can't, I can't do that. I, I can't. If you want to hold my feet, I'll do. I'll do push-ups as you hold my feet, but that's it. I'm gonna do one while I'm handstanding. Oh, yeah, do it. I go. I would go right back over. Great balance. That's awesome balance. <laughs> <laughs> you know, be great. Very good. Very good. Very good. All right. All right. Awesome. Great.